business tonight, baby! It's been an exciting season already, Doris, but I think the middle of the year is when you really get an idea of which teams are in it for the long haul. They, they reveal their true selves. Right. By the midpoint of the season, the best teams are really starting to take shape. Everyone's much more dialed in. You can tell that winning matters, that the groups are collectively pulling in the same direction. So I agree. By this time of the year, we have a pretty good idea who is going to win and win consistently. Shot clock at two. We had a nice open look right there. Well, just so good at recognizing, hey, perhaps it's my opportunity from distance now. Barnes against Wiggins. Pass to Siakam. Back to Barnes, and it's Barnes slamming it down. Boy, Pascal Siakam plays at his own pace, able to find the open man. A moment now to hear from our sideline reporter, Hall of Famer, David Aldridge. David. I caught up with coach Nick Nurse. He wants his guys to focus on jamming the perimeter shooters. He wants hard closeouts, no room to operate. He knows what this team can do if you give them any space on the outside to shoot. And they're going to be determined not to let that happen. Kevin? All right, David, thank you. Obviously, the three ball is a big concern for any defense. Guys, I've got to say, one of the things I love the most about the Toronto Raptors, how special their fan base is. Really, when you think about it, Canada much more associated with the great sport of hockey, but they love professional basketball. That's a great beginning. Three for three from the floor. Barnes outside. Pass to Flynn. Back to Barnes. Trying to find Ananobi, gets it to him. When you have vision at the forward spot, it always opens up and elevates the team. Scotty Barnes passing on display. To the paint. It's Curry. That time on the assist by Wiggins. Curry's got his second bucket of the night. Oh, you're right. This fan base here in Toronto is terrific and certainly gets excited to cheer on their Raptors. They, they love them. They do, and their theme is, quote, we the North. You can truly tell how much these fans love the Raptors. Remember the scene in Jurassic Park outside the stadium, that special area when the finals were going on in 2019. It was pure pandemonium. Yes, that goes in. Curry's got six. I think you can make a strong case that Draymond Green is the best passing four in the league. Unreal court vision. Siakam outside. Down low, Pirtle. First shot, first pass. He's out of the blocks fast. Well, this is the kind of pass that gets everyone excited. And it's also how you build great team chemistry. Siakam against Green. Green with a screen for Wiggins. Another three for Golden State. And their offense already in a flow. Some stellar shooting to jump out to this league. Curry against Flynn. There's the pass to Siakam. Inside. And he jams it with authority. <laughs> the vertical of OG and Anobi. Go ahead, sir. Finish with authority. And you watch the way that Siakam plays. It can get you in the open court or in half court sets. Great forward who gives you a little bit of everything. Now here's Curry. Kicks it to Henry. For the three. Another three for Golden State. Yeah, that's back to back threes. The D just seems to be slacking off a little bit. So timeout called here. The first four. Comes at 
The free throw drops for Trent. Gary Trent Jr., to me, guys, the very definition of a true shooter. He believes it's a natural talent, but he also works to develop himself into a reliable and efficient shooter. The forwards are Barnes and Siakam. Gary Trent is out there with OG Ananobi. And it's Pirtle in at the five. So that's the five in the game for Toronto. And the wait is now from our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David, it's all yours. Take it away. Well, guys, Slim in the last outing against Philadelphia played some huge minutes. He had 19 points. And it seemed like every shot he put up was going in. That's how dialed in he was. They're winning games all over the place, and he's been a factor in that success. His confidence has to be sorry. Kevin? Yeah, David in stretches. He was absolutely down. Great. He'd love to match that performance tonight. This team needs his contributions. When he's right, he makes winning plays time and time again. Well, when you're coming off a game like he had, you know the difference tonight. They're going to load up against him. They're going to try to take him out of his rhythm early. Here's Hananobi. No good. They had a chance to end the run there. Boy, nine times out of ten, that's going in. I'm sure he surprised himself with the miss. Green taking his time here. A deep three from Thompson. Good, and it's Green picking up the assist. Green's got three assists tonight. And it just seems that every pass they make is leading to a score. Just great ball movement. On an OB, and down it goes. Dunk through off a wonderful assist. Boy, it doesn't get any easier than that. What a size advantage and just goes to work. Here's Henry. Coming off a stellar performance against Philadelphia. Barnes against Thompson. So the wing on the left. Here's Henry. No oh, good on the three. Raptors trail by 16. 151 left to play in the first half. Ananobi with it. He has six. Passes to Trent. I'm deep. Green with the rebound. Here's the Warriors with the ball. It's a 12-2 run here. Good pace. And stolen by Siakam. Thompson against Barnes. Siakam passes to Ananobi. Back to Siakam. Stay there, stay there, stay there. Pass to Ananobi. Trent outside. Launches it. Green with the rebound. Green's got his fourth rebound in this one. Boy, with his shot not falling right now, it might be time to look in a different direction. See if you can get your teammates started. Takes a three, and he nails the three. Nice shot from beyond the arc there from Henry. Henry's got 12 in the game. Some tough offensive sets. They want to turn it around. Yeah, right now, you just need a bucket to get some momentum. Siakam against Green. Green with the block. Simply cannot throw up that weak stuff around Draymond Green. You'll hear about it. He will relish the opportunity to send it back. Yeah, this looks like a pregame shoot-around with all the threes they're allowing. Barnes outside. Here's Siakam. Barnes trying to free himself up. Second chance shot. And Siakam with the nice bucket inside. Now Pascal Siakam showing you I can do a little bit of everything. You need an offensive rebound, a second chance opportunity, willing to do what it takes. Curry deciding where to go with it. Deflects the pass and stolen by Barnes. A dominating first half of basketball and so far hasn't been close. The Warriors on top ending the second quarter with a huge surge an 18 to 4 run. We'll be back shortly, live from Toronto.
Come one, come all. The 2K halftime is here, and so is our breakdown of the upcoming schedule. Let's check it out. In that game against the Knicks, they're slight favorites in this matchup. Listen, if you want to improve your standing in this league, these are the games that you have to win. Should be a good one. Now moving on to the game at hand, some challenges in this first half for the Toronto Raptors. The shooting percentage they allow is through the roof. Their coach should absolutely be ripping into the defensive effort. They need to take some pride on the other end and just lock it in, lock it in, lock it in. And that about wraps it up. And as the third quarter is about to begin, we go to Kevin Harlan for the call. And there wasn't too much drama in the first half, but maybe things will tighten up here in the second. Slim having a dominant impact in this game. Yeah, he's just been raining down on them from deep here. Talk about dialed in. Well, the break certainly didn't have a cooling effect on him at all. He's in a great rhythm, looking comfortable and confident. Oh, and with all the gifted rain shooters in this lake, Doris, it seems like in the clutch, more teams go for those long-distance, uh, quote-unquote, Hail Mary threes, rather than uh, two quick field goals inside. Well, it makes sense if you have guys who work on those types of shots. We see Stephen Curry do this all the time. But I don't always agree that that should be the play. If you have the time, go for high percentage two-point looks. And on the floor for Steve Kerr as we get into the second half, we'll see Wiggins and Green play in the forward spots. Stephen Curry is out there with Slim, and it's Green in at the five, Roman the paint. Five to shoot. Toronto needs to get off his shot. Releases from 15. Siaka misses. Listen, he knows he should have made that shot. We'll see if they can work it back to him in that same area. And while we've got a moment, let's send it over to our terrific reporter, David Aldridge. David. Thanks, guys. A busy few years for Nick Nurse in 2019. He helped lead the Raptors to the title. we can go out there and give them something to be proud of. Of course, Kevin, he's been a key part of that success. Back to you. Maybe the single most important part of their success, DA. Thank you so much. Catching up on the changes for Toronto. Chris Boucher comes in for Jakob Bertel. And it's Miles Bridges in for Pascal Siakam. Flynn misses. Yeah, and they've shown effort and aggression in the paint, really, right from the tip. Their rebounding edge right now, massive. Kaminga dishes to Wiggins. And here is Kaminga. Looking at his point production, he averages almost eight points a game. Here's Curry. Again, Golden State. And they've had assists now on their last three baskets. The Raptors have gone 0-3 and are still looking for that first bucket here in the second half. Bridges kicks to Flynn. Back to Bridges. The shot's good on the assist by Flynn. Bridges has got his first two points of the night. Well, their first basket in four tries. Can that trigger a little bit of good shooting here? We'll find out. And that was another look at the fantastic Mobile One drive that happened a moment ago. And they might be down big, but you'd love the mentality he has to go at defenders and just keep attacking. Curry against Flynn. Outside Curry to the wing right side. Fires the three. Another three for Golden State. Uh, assists like that have typified their effort today. Terrific ball movement. Well, we're into the third quarter. Just over two and a half minutes play. They need a bucket in a big way here to regain some confidence. Here's Bridges. And Bridges jams it in. Well, this guy knows how to put on a show. Put Miles Bridges in the dunk contest. Did you see that? And they're bringing you up close and personal on the AT&T 5G Slam Cam. The Warriors have gone four for four from the field since the halftime break. Terrific start to the third quarter. Now Henry, 18 points for him. 
on the wing Wiggins covered by Barnes down to five on the shot clock Barnes against Wiggins yep that one goes in there Wiggins has got his third bucket of the night well he's got the wide shoulders the natural balance Andrew Wiggins taking the hit and finishing outside Flynn with the drive shoots over Curry here's Bridges and at the line for Toronto. That one fall. Substitution on the court. Sort of the gas, MP. Get in there. Bridges against Curry. Bridges passes to Trent. And a missed layup. Warriors leading by 18. Underneath in the post, it's Siakam and Achua. Bridges out there with Gary Trent. And it's Boucher in at the small forward. That's the five out there for the Raptors. Here's Siakam. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. It, but the effort's been there for him, just not getting the results. Back to Curry. I'm open. To the middle, here's Henry. Doesn't go for him. And it's the Raptors taking it the other way. Bridges finds Achua. Siakam outside. Boucher sets a screen for Siakam. And they hit it back. Bridges, no one around him. And again, no good by Toronto. And it's Wiggins with the ball for the Warriors. It's an 18-point game. Out to the wing. Looney kicks to Henry. Pass to Kaminga. Just five to shoot. Golden State needs to get off a shot. Looney with the bucket. Always a bonus when points come from unlikely sources. And you can see this guy's been working on that shot. There's the lob to Bridges. Trent gets the bucket. And this is going to end in a lopsided victory. I, I love the tenacity and aggressiveness, as well as the ability to close. You really got to give it up here for the Warriors. And the big difference here was accuracy from three-point range. And once they started sinking shots, they really stretched out the D and created other opportunities. And any time they got space, they seemed to just knock down another triple. And so taking a look at their season record, this will be win number 31 on the year. And so they win their first game against this squad. It's a two-game season series, and they'll be going for the sweep the next time they face off. The one player that really stands out, of course, in this one, it was a dazzling game for Slim. It was the kind of game for him that all scorers dream of, where the basket seemed as wide as a barrel. Outside Curry. 40 seconds left to play here in the fourth. The pass to Kaminga. Back to Curry. Wiggins outside. Over Boucher and off the left side of the rim, and it swirls in for him. And the Warriors lead by 21. Pass to Boucher. Sixteen seconds left in the fourth quarter. Siakam inside. Defended by Kaminga. Siakam's shot is off. Here's Henry. So we see the Warriors taking the game here. This crowd was stunned by the manner in which their team was dismantled. You know what? Shocking. I don't care what the matchup is. You never expect a road team to come in and just cruise to the kind of win they did tonight. And that'll do it, folks.
For Doris Burke, David Aldridge, Greg Anthony, and the rest of our terrific 2K Sports crew, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Fantastic shooting night for you. How did you manage to get so many open looks? <laughs> Thanks, Candace. I don't know, honestly. Um, I told my teammates early on, you know, they're leaving me open. So if they're gonna step back and let me take open three-pointers, I'm gonna let it fly, you know? Now, I have no idea what they were thinking. Well, do you feel like people are starting to figure out how good you can be? They don't know yet. They gonna find out, you know. Your boy is here to win, and I hate losing. You know, I know you're not gonna win every game, but you can't get used to losing. So yeah, I get mad, you know, and I take over games too. Listen, I'll do whatever it takes not to lose. Well, keep shooting like tonight, and you shouldn't lose too many games. Thanks so much. Thank you.